Hello, and welcome back to Nelly Nerds. I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. And we're playing... GeoGuessr. GeoGuessr. And I've never done this before, but... I've seen lots of people do this, so this might be, you know, a weird <clears> little <throat> test run here. All right, so we have to guess where it puts us. Where the location puts us, yes. All right, so let's do this. Play! All right, so we're in the U.S., only in the U.S., only in the U.S. So it puts us in a Google Maps location. With oh, so oh, that's what I was wondering. It gives so we you know, we know we're in the U.S. Yeah. So you can pick your location. So I pick the U.S. And we're in the middle of nowhere. Oh my goodness. Well, okay, it's flat. There's uh, no mountains, right? I'm thinking somewhere m- Midwest. Okay. So let's just preemptively. Yeah. So, so when we're done, we we click, and that's and then that's our guess. A lot of clouds fairly green now so i want to say that i want to do that our hints are how many clicks we want to move to try and find a sign okay so i say no more than five no more than five well there's nothing that we want to do hints so if we're going to go we're going to go the other way right because there's some buildings over there that is a little weird to control um this way oh my god if we're going to go anywhere we would go that way but we don't have to go there yet let's just think I'm thinking like Kansas, Iowa. Nebraska, or something. I'm thinking like Iowa. Well, the way the clouds are, that kind of reminds me of like Oklahoma ish. So that's why I'm thinking Kansas. It's not. It's too green, maybe for Oklahoma or Kansas, though. Maybe Nebraska. Maybe possibly Wyoming. No. Well, yeah, if you're on that side of Wyoming, but the, Wyoming is still more in the Rockies. You know what I mean? Yeah. So I'm I'm thinking. I'm thinking Kansas. I'm thinking, I'm thinking but, Iowa. So when we put our guess in, where do we put it in at? So that'd be that'd be where you put it, then you hit make a guess when oh, you're finally sure. It's supposed to be on the highway, I guess. So we're on a highway. It's a small highway. It's a two laner. So it's not so. gonna be like. Oh my god! How the hell are you supposed to know where this is? <laughs> well, so it's it, you get a pretty high score if you're really close. Okay. Yeah, okay, I say we're in Kansas somewhere. That's my guess. So here's Kansas. Were you thinking like here-ish, there-ish, there-ish? Sure, northern Kansas somewhere. Well, it's not going to be there, so right about there. Because I say it's more Um, further north. Iowa and Missouri, like right here. Okay. So I'm doing that side of Kansas. All right. So see who's closest. Oh! Oh man, Minnesota. Minnesota. <laughs> that not did not close. look close. I guess Iowa would have been closer if you said it was. So Iowa. we were 610 miles from the correct location. So well, we, we knew it was Midwest. We scored <clears throat> 1,400 points basically. Okay, next round. Next round. I have no idea if that's good or not. So we did. It's five rounds of this. Oh my god, these are so. Ru- I mean, if they at least do like maybe a town or a city. Yeah. Sometimes, sometimes you get legit cities. Sometimes it's just. All right, so it's got like a hedgerow kind of planted, like it's trees planted alongside the road. This makes me think that it's like northern uh, Idaho. Me personally, though. Yeah. No, I don't want to. Like somewhere like right there between like Montana and... And Idaho? And Idaho. Oh, yeah, so it's green forest, pine, it's a pine forest. That, yeah, that, that speaks more west than east because <clears throat> it's a pine forest mostly. Yep. Aspen esque looking trees. So go left and right. Let's look at the highway. Look up and down the highway again. And look at the other side of the road I'd like to see. Yeah, this is so weird. We have an control. open field. There's not a lot of mountains again. But this is like farmland, which makes me think. Hey, yeah, farmland all over the Midwest. Yeah. But it's a lot of trees. Um Oh my goodness. But see I mean Idaho is full of mountains. And that's north, by the way. Oh, okay. That, that makes a huge difference. Yeah, but see, I'm just not seeing mountains again. So I'm thinking, and it's not like a red clay, is there? <clears> on <throat> the ground? Because <clears throat> that would make me think of the south. Nope. I'm thinking... Although that kind of road is reminiscent of like Utah and Idaho. But the thing is, there are a lot of prairies, you know, in some of these high mountain areas. So if, they're, if you're really high up, you won't see mountains because you're in a high prairie. Yeah. But it, I, see, I just don't know where we're at. If we're at sea level, then this is definitely the Midwest again because there's no mountains. It's all flat. Yeah. I'm going to go Wyoming. 
Wyoming. So let's do. Well, let's, you can choose your. Yeah. Let's, let's cut the difference. So on the border, Wyoming and Idaho, Idaho and Utah. Idaho. All right. Because those roads remind me of like St. George. Okay. All right. Make a guess. Ah, oh, I bet you in the south. Oh, Wisconsin. Wisconsin. All right. They're doing. It's all been by the Great Lakes area. Oh, that was that was a thousand was miles away from it. It was flat again. That's what I mean. We. we there's okay, not here we mountains. Go. We got we got houses. Okay, we got housing. Usually, you can tell sometimes with Somehow. mailboxes and streets. Streets. See, so, I mean, like it can look like a neighborhood in, a, in an area you you know, but I'm look, I'm trying to look for like big one for me is again no mountains. Yeah. So I say we gotta get away from the Rockies. So circle around and just tell me if you see any mountains on the horizon. And this is kind of hard because of all the trees, but I'm not seeing mountains <laughs> no, on the horizon not again. either. So I'm thinking again, it's going to be in the in the Midwest again. Um, I mean, it's been Wisconsin, Minnesota. I don't know if there's a if there's a theme, but I'm banking it's going to be up in that area again. I'm going to go Michigan, Indiana. I mean, it, it, uh, if it, if it could know the time of the year, because right. you know, if it's if it, if it's in the Southwest, it could be this green in the middle of, <laughs> you know, of February possibly. Where if it's oh, in a, a Minnesota better, or something, it's that's a better be, view. Holy crap! Oh, you scroll back a little bit. Yeah, yeah. So what are you saying? I'm saying like Indiana, Michigan. Michigan. I feel like the sky's too blue for Michigan, but I don't know. I've never been there. All I've ever seen Michigan is like in documentaries. It's always kind of gray. Well, that's that side of Michigan. I know, but that's all I've ever seen. Um, yeah, okay. I'll, I'll I'll go with you on this. We'll say Michigan area. Let's let's uh, Iowa, Indiana, Michigan. Okay. Split the difference since we still don't. It's know gonna for be sure. it's gonna be Washington. Oh. oh, Ohio. I was pretty close. Is it Ohio? Yeah. Yeah. It's Cleveland right there. And actually, no, that's uh. Zoom out a little bit. Pennsylvania. Pennsylvania, right on the border. Though. Wow. Although the, the the Great Lakes. Yeah, it's, it's been doing the Great Lakes area. That's our highest score yet. <laughs> yeah. Well, we're not that far. All right, last round. Ooh. Or sorry, second to last round. Second to last round. This <clears throat> reminds me of... It's on a hill, but again, I'm looking at the horizon. This reminds me of Texas. It has that, like, yeah, it's got that warm, like, the, the Texas sky. Like, it's like not, well, not so, deep blue. So my sister in, uh, shoot, I forget, I forget the fort down near... Red uh, brick, ranch-style houses, right? Yeah. With the big wraparound. Yeah, Texas, Oklahoma, or something like that. I get what you're saying. Like... So my sister used to live like south of San Antonio towards it was like a, it was a fort. Yeah, this reminds me of Fixer Upper a little bit. Though those houses are a little close together for Texas. I guess it depends on where you're at. I want to see if I can find it. Texas is so big, we could actually get it right in the state and get a lower score than we just got cuz the distance could be further. <laughs> I'm not thinking it'll be southern Texas though. I think it'll be more eastern Texas. <sighs> The fort. It was like Fort... Fort Hood? Fort Hood, yes. Because I flew into San Antonio, and then I was driven to so Fort Hood. Zoom out a little bit. I'm thinking close... Not necessarily in Houston, but I'm thinking somewhere between Houston and Dallas. So like right about here-ish? Yeah. Maybe a little further north, but... I don't know. Maybe a little further north. Get a little closer to Oklahoma. Closer to Dallas. Boop. Yeah, and then a little bit further east. Right there. That's where I'm thinking. I could be totally wrong. All right. Let's make a guess. All right, let's do it. Yeah, kid, there's Killikin. It's going to be in the the northeast again. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Carolina. My oh, see? Oh. oh, it's hard. I should look for the red clay again because the Carolinas. Yeah. Or is it Virginia? It looks like it's, it's on right, the line. It's on the Virginia side. It's on Virginia. Yep, yep. I just don't know. I've never been I've never been east of Kansas. I have. And and when I was in Kansas, I was like 4 or 5. <laughs> I've been Colorado oh, and West mostly my whole life. We're bad at this. All right, last okay. one. Last one. Oh, I mean, these are... See, now this reminds me of Utah again. This reminds me of like Arizona, New Mexico. This this looks like... To me, this looks like a forest in the, north, in the, in the southwest. This reminds me like here. All right, or well, here. So we, well, the red clay makes me think Utah. The red in the dirt. It's mountains. Yeah, we're in the mountains. Oh, but there's some de- deciduous stuff that I don't rec- That's right there. That reminds me of Nevada and Utah mountain areas. Yeah. Kind of reminds I'm me thinking of like I'm thinking here. southwest. Let's do the border. Do the Utah, Nevada, Arizona border. Right St. Georgian area. 
I feel like you'd be further north than that, though. I'm I'm not feeling Nevada too much. Like Southern Nevada, yes. Well, it's the red clay. Yes. That's what it is doing. It's that, well, that red, so the red like, earth. So, like, let's go. Arizona, Nevada, Utah border? Yeah. All right. You ready? Yeah, our score's All right, everybody. Let's see how bad we are. Boop. Newbie. <laughs> that's our overall score because it was Oregon. Oh, my goodness. I guess what with some of those plants that I said they were kind of deciduous looking ones that yeah. didn't quite match the area. All right. Let's look at our summary. <laughs> Wow, that was our best guess. That's actually pretty good. I think if you think about, it. we didn't, we never used any like, we never looked for signs. No, we never, we never. I guess we just rotated. Either way, I don't know how <laughs> I feel about this game, but it could be fun. The uh, more better we, get, the more we play it, the better. The we more can better. Be. The more better. The more better. What's I more s- better? I speak so good. I speak so good. All right, that's gonna do it for this episode of Nightly Nerds. As always, I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. And we'll catch you guys on the flip side. Bye-bye. Hey, did you like that video? Well, if you did, click the box on the right for another. Click the box on the left for a playlist. Of course, you could always just subscribe by clicking the link in the middle. Come find us on social media. There are links in the description below. Don't be afraid to leave us a comment. Thanks for watching. I'm Tote. I'm Ginger. See you then. Bye.